Good evening, viewers. This is Deepika Lindor, bringing to you the news and events in Meghalaya from the Bosco Media Network. Let us first have a look at the headlines for today. HANF urges Meghalaya Chief Minister Conrad K. Sangma to immediately take up with the Assam government to solve the long pending border issue. Former chairperson of Meghalaya State Women's Commission, Dr. Bilodis Lindem, says parents should take care of their adults and children. MCCL employees protest against 15 months unpaid salary. And RTI activists ostracized by Kindok Wala And now the news in detail. Hinyotrep Achik National Movement today urged the Meghalaya Chief Minister Conrad K. Sangma to immediately take up with the Assam government to solve the long pending border issue of the two states. Submitting memorandum to the Chief Minister at the main secretariat in Shillong, today the HANM said, The people of Meghalaya who are living along the Meghalaya-Assam border are facing enormous hardships, including land encroachment from the neighbouring state. Speaking to media after submitting memorandum, the President of HANM Central Body, El Karbani, said, The two states should maintain status quo, while the border issue is yet to be resolved. On the other hand, the organizing secretary and legal advisor of HANM Central Body, Kirshan Lang Marbanyang, said that it is long overdue that the two states should immediately solve the border issue so that the people of Meghalaya who are living along the borders will not face hardship. Our momentum in related with the border dispute, so since right from 1972, the HNM with a deep concern. We have seen like huh, the media, especially the local uh, media, they have surfaced many atrocities, problems with regard to this border dispute. Then the HNM being the organization who look after them. And our main issues are border issues. Then we are very much concerned. Then we came today, we urged the, our chief minister at least to take an initiative, uh, bilateral uh, meeting with the government of Assam. And if the government of Assam could not do anything, then the chief minister should invite the central government to intervene in regard with these matters. The problem is that we have seen that atrocities, murdering, those are the problems like huh, day to day life, these people who are staying in the border is getting their facings. The chief minister he has given an assurance. He said that huh, he had a very tight schedule because huh, of this pandemic. So and moreover nowadays he has so many meetings that he have to be huh, met with many chief ministers. Then he has given an assurance that he will take as soon as possible that meeting with the uh, Chief Minister of Assam or the government of Assam, then we will see to it. We urge the Chief Minister and the government of the day at least to take serious note in regard with this uh, border dispute so that no untoward incident will happen in near future. Former chairperson of Meghalaya State Women's Commission, Dr. Bilores Lindem, today said parents are the good caretaker of children and reiterated that many of them forget to take care of the children during their adolescent stage. Speaking to Don Bosco Media Network, Lindem said that parents should be very careful not to entrust their young children to anyone as this may put them in danger. She also stresses the need to see that the children do not leave school as this will only create problems in the society. We have the State Women's Commission which was instituted um, around about in 2004 where I became the first chairperson, it was uh, quite, I mean, I, I mean, quite uh, uh, mind-boggling because I was thinking, what is this? What does it mean? Then I found out that this commission is actually helping a lot the women and children in the state, will be helping a lot of women and children in the, in the state. With the coming of the commission, we have uh, created a lot of awareness about many people giving a lot of, uh, you know, problem and then creating a lot of uh, harassment of women and children in the state. Now we have also the Child's Right Commission, which is also a new uh, outcome, of a new outcome of the commission. And I wish that the, this two commission will work closely so that they can tackle this problem and create uh, awareness among the people so that they do not uh, have any... Uh, a problem with uh, with our women and children and in this connection I would like to say in the particularly with the uh, women of Meghalaya the parents they're really good taker of their kids they take good care they are known to be care they are the best nannies I could say the ayahs of the of the kids but the moment they grow up they forget 
they forget the adolescent stage which is the most important time that they have to take care that part they forget they do not take so much of care so we have a lot of problem with the adolescence children do the government of india have got a scheme for the adolescence children and a lot of um, um, of work has been done by the by the block department block each block and every community leaders and all but till today we have uh, still a lot of things to do in in communicating the problem of the adolescent kids both boys and girls this is actually the issue that we have to tackle and you want to bring up our kids in a proper way and to reduce also the dropout rates and at the same time to make the kids aware that they are also a responsible citizen to be the responsible citizen of the state now thinking about this i think i have i have done one small uh, project with another person which the copy i don't have at present here uh, i have kept it in the library in mausundram the urban and the rural there's a lot of problem with the urban kids because the parents they do not have i believe they do not have time enough or they are not conscious about the problem of the adolescent children so we find early teen age pregnancy is also common for that reason so we have to take uh, this i think is a big issue we have to take up um, this matter in a proper way and uh, make a survey and then uh, do some research work and find out uh, as a, as a benchmark to tackle this problem now talking about the the women of meghalaya they are very very they are very trust worthy people they do not have any thing to to think about their kids when they have as i just give i give you one a small example there's one lady who uh, has been a small she has got a small shop in limok uh, nongpo area and there's one person who goes from shillong to nongpo every day for his job he used to visit that shop almost every day for nearly 8 or 9 years and she had small kids and uh, the girls and boys and all and then this one is about age of age of 8 or 9 like that she grew up into a 12 year old girl and then one day she had to sell some pumpkin and she said go go with mama uncle go with the uncle and you get and collect all the pumpkins from the from the go down and then she was thinking that how this is shop uh, somewhere in the main road and the, the go down is not very far it's only about 10 minutes walk and she never returned and when she didn't return she went there and she found her own daughter bleeding in the go down so this is one example i'm giving you that we trust and we keep calling people who unknown people uncle and then you know uh, my own relative and we start calling them our own blood so this is also another issue that we have to make aware now right to information activists over welling door of kindon walang village and the soyong area in east kasi hills was ostracized by the village dorbar for filing an rti relating to the construction of cc road from pwd road to lumjing tep presbyterian at kindon walang village over welling door has filed an rti along with his colleague simon jarang but the village dorbar which was held on the 21st of this month decided to oust him and not his colleague The village dorbar has also threatened the villagers with dire consequences for associating with overwhelming dog. Speaking to media, overwhelming dog strongly criticized the decision of the village dorbar as he has the right to seek information from the government relating to any irregularities. Ngade nga ngade ba overwhelming dog. Oba syang bersa ak sinong kendong walang. De na kamen sim ke basngok ya ngawan hang ni ya ka ban pensai bat ya ka ba ngan wan ban ya thu akmat jong pi ang ne kum ki khubor ya ka ba nga kum unong song snong jong snong kendong walang ya ka ba nga ngala sya be snong ha ka snong kendong walang na ka ben ha ka ha ka ar pui trek bune ba khat wei snam ar jar ar phau kalong ban nin si sejan te ha nin si sejan ka dorbar snong kala khat ya ka jing nyala ya ka dorbar snong bro ka wei ha ka jing yalam jong u rang ba snong u ba sngan sing nong ri ba sketri snong u ba jis komar nta tiang te kila khat ia kene ka dorbar te on lai kren ka dorbar ka dorbar ka long ba i la ya kren 
ya kawe halor ke jingtrei ke badai hapo jokene ke sinam ke bangi dang menta kendiat sengi ngidang ujor ya kene ke jingtrei ya ke ba kene ke jingtrei ke long ke jingtrei na ke menta ke surak putpat sisi rut lum jingtep balang perestrian bat lum jingtep balang ke thlek de halor ke bangi ujor ya kene ke jingtrei Ona ujor kene ke jingtrei ya ka bangi lap halor ha ya ka atiai ke bala yo ba Anda kencing tray, kat kum ke plan estimate ke day, tahun si Henry, hak bangi lap mengi pat kum kinong song song, kalong tang lain si, te halor kata kenong rim, ke bangi ni dawa ya ke ba, idei ban pen tray biang kat kum ke plan estimate ke balai yok leblok, te halor kata kene kine kinong kit kam song, bat ke song kinong kit kam barok kira mak song kum tu tetar, kila Kot dorbar ringi menin haka arfu eterek kira kot dorbar ngala ekran ki ong bas lendar no yang ngana ka benta jong ka tai ke jing terei ba fi dei ban selendar no ba ya ka tai ke jing terei ke ba fi ujor manga bat uba simon jarang bala ujor ban penterei ba ha biang ya ke tukujing terei di alor ka ta haka bangi ngila ujor ya ka ne ke jing terei ban penterei ba ha te ki ne pat ki ong selendar no ueng no ya ka ne Dia nak keliang jungang ong ba umngam la ban weng ya kene ha ke bangi ngi lap ba kene ke jing tray ka dei ke badang duna kat kum ke plan estimate ke bala ai na pok blok of his te fi dei ban pen tray biang ya kene dala pen tray ba dala dep ya kene ke jing pen tray ke bangi ngi ujor te ya kata ladang ngi ngi ila le ya kata ngi ka kam ke la ke la bahi la ke ya ha pok sinang te dei nak ke bentak ke da ke ta ke dau ke bapak selendar Hendri ki pat ba nang sichnong katu kat ne bat ki rong ba sichnong ki ong la da um tun dar ka ne ngin be sichnong no ipi. Meanwhile, Simon Jarang expressed utter surprise that the villagers did not take action against him while filing the FIR along with the overwhelming dog. Hak be dei bat ka ni ka jing sa be sichnong no jong ni opa over bareng do. Um we na ki na ujor per sa ka ni ka jing tray em na ra GS mo. Ba ba ka ba la ba tai sikmat la pen tray na ka Lum jiktep as kena surok ba sa lum jiktep joka balang katolik ba na surok sa lum jiktep ba balang prostrian. Te ngarung ngadi uwei ngunung ujor mo yang ini kam <hesitation> ngadi uwei ni ngunung ujor yang ini kam henrei kapang ilu ipat hapo <hesitation> kapala long ka <hesitation> dorbar sinong menin si sejanya kui terik balang kat uwei kat kung karai kapala rai yang tu pat kila ong ba <hesitation> nde sinong no yau mo nde sinong no yuni uba uba bel. But ngapa ngah keli yang ngapa lah sabi ni em moh re yang ngah kembe moh kem keren ish panggil ngah moh de atau sendai se leda kata kejengle jung u ngah dengan perem jol hayak kejengle jung u bau ha moh kejengle jung u bagi jengle jung a ha pen pak tray biang itu jeng tray nama arbaki ialah tray torti moh kali tray torti klem tak klem long kumak ya lah estimate ni kembali pelan Rai tang namar ba, pak tray biang ya kete isu be sinong no, mo, te nga kum we lakin nong sik sinong, bat kum juru unong ya kesan lang bat u, ya kene kam, te lakun kum nori hap ban wat aka we ka laat kan ti mo, ban u jua sipa sakmat, ban ngin nya sakmat, laka dei hakan okan okom, ngin nya wat kin ti, ngin se, lada kusor kar ko ong ba ombet, ya ngi pengin wat aki ai. Nah, pengin ujar ya kencing tray. Esok besokar kau orang bermimpi yang ini pengin lihat kita ni hap ni ni hap lihat kita hari lada besokar kau orang bah Juno Juno bah buat api air lihat si lada kumpul kesinong kapan sistem dia kumpul ni hap buat dia kahok nanta kan? Mo ni hap buat dia kahok nanta. Te nalar kata mo ni layu orang suka nak kalian ke office mo ni layu orang suka jing pensia nak kalian ke office bahkan ni kencing tray lawan di engineeri lawan lah ada engineeri bahkan ni kencing tray kalong ke bah duna mo senjat Bench pulih ni, mo as per plan estimate the thickness of CC is zero point one ten meter, but on inspection at site it it was found that the thickness of CC is only zero point zero twenty five meter, and is and in some stretch it was less than zero point zero twenty five meter, and the reason given by them is due to heavy rain which which wash away the newly laid cement concrete and also the mix of cement and sandstone is too weak. As learned, 
the office bearers and employees of MCCL have been agitating and protesting against the company management to sanction their pending salaries of 15 months. The employees informed that they have to fight and struggle with for their deserving right to receive their hard-earned money. It is to be noted again that the salary of 15 months has not yet been released. This could have a detrimental effect mentally as well as financially. The agitators are priced that on the 26th of November, they will organize a hunger strike in protest against the injustice. On the 24th of November 2020, the Hnyotreb Achik National Movement Maulai Circle met with the Cabinet Minister Snyao Bhalang Dhar to appeal to the State Government of Meghalaya to probe into the unsanitary conditions of the margin, which has an utter reek that stinks as well as unhygienic contaminated Waukra River. The Maulai Circle Movement urges the government to take up the matter as a priority, for it is imperative to have clean surroundings. The residents of Maulai have been dealing with this ordeal for years. The state government should consider resolving the issue with utmost importance, as it is not only for the welfare of the people in Maulai, but for the state as a whole. The minister assured that the matter will be taken as a primacy, and he will apprise the CEO of municipal of the same in order that immediate process to seek a systematic solution to dissolve the existing vermin, which is prejudicial on the health conditions of the people. Well, dear viewers, that is all we have for you today. Until we meet again, thank you for watching.